deep within the most remote region in Florida. There is a place unlike any other, an oasis of high life that only exists in this part of the state. A millionaire's wet dream. A place where stockbrokers will go, oh crap, I gotta invest in this sh It's something only the best that money can buy. And yes, we have furries. So why not stay here and give us your money? Please give us your money. Hello everybody, it's Tim Mr. Fox again and welcome to a brand new video made by yours truly. You may notice this but there's a fan going on in the background because it's really hot and it's Florida and it's December but it's still like it's summer here so yeah I'm sorry about that if it's uh, the noise in the background. But speaking of Florida, someone recently came to the States and it was really interesting to hear from them and say that they're, you know, they're coming to Florida and to Orlando, where I am, it turned out to be Nos Hyena, okay? I'm just gonna say, it, it was Nos. Oh no. Oh, we just went dug it. <laughs> I, I didn't know yet if, if I could go until like the day before because I only have one car and my parents use it to commute. Nos offered a place for me to stay. Speaking of the place to stay, it's it's really um, it, it's mind-boggling. Let's just put it that way. I mean when you go to this place you are just like oh my god this is like the high life. You have, you have this sort of feeling that goes through you. It's like, you're just like throwing money at everything. You feel like rich, even though you're not rich. It, it's, it's not that far away from the parks. It's about like 20 minutes away. The resort, you know, we, uh, we were driving in the resort and we were stopped by a guard and he's like, well, why are you here? You know, no, he didn't actually say that. He said, you know, who are you here for or whatever. After I said, you know, where exactly the villa was, they let us in. Um, and we drove through like the resort and driving through the resort is like booking in a really expensive hotel in the middle of nowhere. Like, I have seen many hotels in Orlando and they're very exclusive and they're very remote and this is one of them. But this one is different from all the rest because you have like really expensive properties and they're like on the site. So you literally live in these five million dollar homes and you walk out and you're on the golf course or you're near the hotel and you're not really that far away from Disney World and it was like this small villa uh, it was a uh, three floors okay we were on the third floor uh, basically a penthouse if you think about it and so I I ran into Nos right in the middle of his live stream it was like about 30 minutes in the live stream and so I wasn't wearing my fursuit because, you know, in places like this, you don't want to go out in a the suit. They'll probably kick you out. I really didn't mind showing my face live or anything. So, you know, I sat down, I talked with Nos. Um, he helped me get more subscribers, which I cannot thank him enough for. I mean, this is really great. I, I, I can't thank you enough, Nos, for doing that. So thank you. We, we did the live stream and we did a lot of silly silly stuff um we, we danced around like <laughs> we went outside for a little bit to look around the internet wasn't really the best and you know that was kind of surprising to me because you know you're 
You're in a five-star resort and yet they don't really have the best internet coverage and you're kind of there going like, what the hell? <laughs> I paid five million dollars for this property and I have like a twenty dollar internet service. Yeah, so we went back inside. We 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 kind of did like not not a skit, but we we I mean I was on the couch and we did sort of like a and uh but after all that, the stream ended, you know, we said goodbye to the audience. We sort of talked for a little bit. I really want to talk about this place where we were staying at. You're there, you're on the third floor, you're on the top floor. And the kitchen is so massive, like it's so crazy how big the kitchen is. And the living room is big, it has a great size TV, it has a balcony outside. There's two balconies in the apartment, which is quite ridiculous if you ask me, but... You go into the master bed and then I think one of the first things you see in a master bed is that there's a tub right next to the entrance to the bathroom and you're like, why is there a bathtub in the master bedroom? The bathroom is pretty big. The shower is kind of small. I mean, I've seen bigger showers, but you know, that's just me. It, it's a pretty decently sized apartment. I mean, to Nos, I mean, he was just like going crazy. Like he was loving every minute of it. And, and I was, I was too. I mean, I looked at the apartment, I'm like, wow, you know, for, for all of this and, and you know, you're in a really nice place. We were gonna go out to meet somebody else at Disney World. We got a, we, we got a Uber. And I, I was out of suit at this point because I, I wasn't gonna take my first suit to uh, Disney. It took like 20 minutes to get to Disney's Hollywood Studios. And when we got there, we met up with another furry. His name is Nova. I know he has a longer name, but that's his name, Nova. And we hanged out with him. We went into the park at around five in the afternoon and it was already getting dark and the park was gonna close at eight so we only had like three two or three hours to go around we so we went around we got we got starbucks we did uh tower of terror which was really awesome by the way nos loved it and then we did rocking roller coaster it's an indoor roller coaster and when you're in the roller coaster aerosmith plays and it's um it's really cool because you go through loops and everything you don't really do that in Space Mountain, so you know it, it's kind of it's, it's a big step up. So after that, um, we saw fireworks. We took pictures, um, took several selfies, and then after that, we went out of the park. We said goodbye to Nova, and then we went back to the resort. So after going to Disney. Uh, we did uh, Nos's video. I mean, we did it all in one take and everything just happened so perfectly that we decided to keep everything. Like, it was, it, everything just fell into place so perfectly. And we were both like, oh my God, like, it's so good. <laughs> After that, we hang out for a bit. We ordered food at around, I, th I would say, two in the morning, literally. Uh, we did a video, it's a collaboration. Uh, Nos had to go to sleep because he had a he had to go to the airport at five in the morning like oh My god, and I barely had any sleep. I slept in the couch. He slept on the bed So I slept in the living room. I Could barely fall asleep and when I did when I did finally go to sleep the alarm started to sound we hugged and we said our goodbyes I said thank you and so I stayed in the villa for a while longer. I woke up at around 9 a.m., 9.30 a.m. I got ready really quickly. I gathered everything. I made sure that Nos didn't leave anything behind, which he didn't. And I, I left the villa at around 10. I went and, and I took footage of the resort. And it ended up being really great footage that we couldn't really get the day before so that way you know we have more footage to share to you guys about the resort and how amazing the resort is 
uh, made sure that Nos was okay. Yeah, so pretty much that was that was Wednesday and Thursday and it was really great meeting Nos again because I met him at MFF. Nos is a really cool person to hang out with. I mean, he's just so awesome. Like how everything went, it was just like so chill. Chill is probably not a word I should be saying because it's really out of character, but I mean, this is this is me speaking, you know. And and speaking of being out of character, I want to really tell you guys how I feel about face reveals because I am about to do one. So, I'm about to show you guys my face and really I feel like I'm confident enough to show you guys my face on the camera. Here we go. So this is Tim is the Fox and you're about to see who is behind the mask. So I hope you guys are ready for that. Fuck, I just made a big mistake, didn't I? I'm really sweating and it, it really shows, but yeah. So I'm Timis. This is the human version of Timis. You know, I'm not scared to show my face on the camera. And you'll probably see videos of me in the future out of fursuit and everything. Because it, it's really fun, you know. I and, and me and Nos talked about it. And like him, I kind of want to divert away from being 100% furry. At least... Not fully, but I'm also trying to like include non-furry content on my channel as well. You will definitely see Timis. Like you will see Timis in a hell of a lot of videos, but you're also going to see my face too. But yeah, so this is me. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this really surprising face reveal that I have just made to everybody on the internet. Hello everybody, it's Tim is the Fox again and I want to give a special shout out to Nos Hyena Thank you so much Nos for inviting me I really appreciate it Aww. And thank you for helping me out with my videos and appearing and my stuff I really appreciate you Yeah, you're welcome. Subscribe to everyone Subscribe to him if you haven't Yeah Everybody who watches yeah. my comments Yay. Subscribe to him Yay. Alright guys, so uh it's time for us to sleep, so okay. We'll see you guys next time. Bye ya! Bye! <laughs>